y'all. How are y'all doing today? Hopefully y'all are having a wonderful day. Thanks for joining me today to watch this video. Y'all, before we get started, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I really would appreciate it. Thank you so much in advance. So what I'm going to be doing today is a completely different type of video. It's kind of a rant, but it's really a story time of a situation that just happened earlier today, this morning. So today is Tuesday. It is January 19th, the day after MLK holiday. Um, and I'm not at work today. I had to take off from work today. My child's, my youngest son's, his daycare is closed today, unfortunately, because of COVID situation. They'll be back open tomorrow, thankfully. And even though I had to take off work, I'm still gonna have to do work <laughs> later on today with a virtual training, um, like a three hour training that I have to do later today. But anyway, I run an errand today, went to Kroger um, to get something. Took my son with me, of course, uh, my tag along friend, and just in and out, had to go get something real quick. And I wanted to get a Starbucks too that day and Starbucks is in my Kroger. And bam, that kills two birds with one stone. I can go ahead and get it done and get my coffee from there. So they were advertising a new coffee pistachio latte that I saw on the entry, in the entry on a sign in the entryway of Kroger. And I also saw um, being displayed um, in the Starbucks, like their back part where it has their menu pretty much. So ordered my drink, waiting patiently with my son, making sure I'm socially distanced from people. Me and my son have on our mask because we go hard for the mask. We go hard for the social distancing. We go hard for the cleanliness. So let me put that out there, first of all. So my drink's ready. They call out the pistachio latte. I've been socially distanced, so I walk up to get it, but the woman that ordered behind me, might I add a maskless? woman grabbed my drink and this is how she grabbed it so this is the counter and she did that this and the barista said oh no that's not yours that's hers and then the barista gets it and hands it to me yeah i don't know what world they think we live in and i do not know why that barista thought that i would want that drink when someone else had touched the lid of it a maskless person and even if the person did have a mask on I don't even care what? so I told the barista very politely and firmly no ma'am I didn't touch the drink y'all I was like no ma'am I'm gonna need a new drink she touched that the top of the lid with her hand um oh well ma'am um I can just get you a new lid I can get you a new lid no ma'am I'm gonna need a new drink oh well I can just pour it in um, a new cup and then you can get a new lid. No ma'am, I'm going to need a new drink. Which finally she proceeded um, to go ahead and be the barista that she was and prepare me a new drink. And the woman, she was like, oh, I thought they said, or she said cinnamon doche, that's mine. I'm sorry. She was apologetic and stuff because she was probably looking like, uh-uh. Y'all. I just, I just couldn't believe that experience that I had that the barista was trying to make excuses and trying to, instead of just being a barista and being a professional during a global pandemic, and even if it wasn't a global pandemic, y'all, if it was January 2019, I would have still demanded a different dream. What, what the heck? Y'all, I was just flabbergasted, like thinking, y'all really think, you think I'm gonna be okay with this $5 drink that somebody else grabbed like this and like, I'm gonna be okay with drinking it? No, ma'am, I am not. She finally proceeded to fix me and prepare a new drink, which she was probably upset about, but I really don't even care how upset she was. It's my money. Um, It is what it is. Prepare my new drink. What? Is it like, have y'all had situations going on like this? And it doesn't even have to be COVID in a global pandemic going on. It's just pre that. That is not acceptable. It, it's just not acceptable. If someone else touches your stuff, I need a new one. Run me my new one. These were her only options that she was going to have. Prepare me a new drink, run me a refund, or let me speak to the manager. She had three options. Thank you for preparing me a drink so we um, can proceed through the rest of our day, get my drink and leave out and handle the rest of the business that I have to do. 
shame on you Starbucks or a Starbucks barista, whichever the case may be. Shame on you, shame on maskless face lady um, for jumping the gun. Boo, you just order your drink. It ain't ready like that for starters. Pretending that she heard the name of her drink. Shame on you too. Be patient, social distance, and number one, wear your mask. Wear your mask. This pandemic is literally killing people. Wear your mask. All right. <sighs> Rants over. You guys, I did this rant in my stories on IG. So if you want to follow me on Instagram, you guys, I'm going to leave my handle somewhere right here and it will be linked also in my description too. If you want to follow me on Instagram, you guys, come on over. Thanks for watching my video, you guys. I know it's not hair related, beauty related, or just Steph related. It's just, yeah, Steph, my experience. Steph story time. Hope y'all enjoyed and I will see you on the next one. Bye.